Welcome everyone to my new episode on e-gold price prediction for June 2024, looking out here putting numbers for Multiverse X platform. We're talking about a cryptocurrency which used to have great potential, unfortunately the price section is not really reflecting that. Although we just followed the altcoin market in the last couple of weeks, which is tremendously on the suffering momentum we're just getting lower lows and putting together more and more pressure on that the idea is quite simple now i did wanted to talk to you about the crypto total market cap chart and present you the situation overall speaking alts have been suffering big time btc compensating for that the crypto total market cap chart is looking different folks it's not bearish it is in a stage where we got out of the correction environment, which was very important to get out of it. And then the number one necessity here is to survive above it. Survival above this specific environment means to respect the line of the environment, which is exactly the green line that comes from the highs and reacts even for the past couple of days we have a triple reaction over there rejecting basically to go lower putting together a you know contact with a demand zone as well around 2.25 2.3 trillion dollars it is a situation where you also have your 100 days moving average holding you so in a nutshell the crypto total market gap even though you get the alts slaughtered indeed btc is pretty much flat it is just likely accumulating and it's allowing the space basically for you know discounted entries i mean at the end of the day that's exactly what we have in the altcoin season before the rallies will restart again a discounted momentum 2.3 trillion dollars seems to be holding nicely you just cannot lose this level and deal basically with a possible outcome afterwards around 1.6 trillion dollars of course that would be quite of a tremendous number out there to put out now this is where we are for the moment definitely looking forward to getting back into the highs definitely looking forward to seeing the market moving above 2.6 trillion dollars on the total market cap for the moment before we continue folks make sure to check out the one-on-one -on -one coaching program if you care about education and believe that by improving your skills and knowledge you can improve the level of your performance if you care about becoming a full-time or a part-time trader this is the possibility including to participate by trades you can find out more about it completely done for you without any prior fees now let's talk about e-gold situation folks on the daily uh and just like i said the bull market at this time seems to be total different it seems to be we just had a rally of the btc etf to prove back in today uh nothing spectacular nothing existent out of the ethereum etf right so uh, you know, they've been approved, but they have not been launched yet. There is still a bit to go probably during the summer. It's going to be out there might get out it on July, which is going to be a great timing. So the idea here is, you know, you got your BTC uh, ETF approved, you spiked and then you, you know, completely come back totally reversed a lot of the people sitting in this cryptocurrency just like in many other altcoins in minus by buying much much higher we simply had here a you know descending pendant and this is usually a bearish outcome which is exactly what has happened you have basically a structure that is falling into a triangle and that triangle is usually a descending pendant into a falling structure will generate a market continuation exactly what you get back into the structure that you know we have as the lowest point guys i mean in terms of the edge in terms of risk and reward these are the levels that we're dealing right now probably the best for long term probably the best to re-enter positions to reinforce your situations around this 20 you know 5 20 9 30 bucks Anything that comes into this zone is actually considered a very strong demand zone, which is pretty much allowing the space to be constructed from where again. So what do you expect from Eagle in the upcoming period? Quite simple, folks. The first target is going to be straight to the $50, the upper supply zone. 50 bucks will be in the first target, which is almost 100% from here. And in order to get that, you might have to see Bitcoin in the all-time high again. You might have to see Ethereum in the all-time high, which is likely due to the fact that they are very, very near to that point and the markets need that momentum for the altcoins to start their rally. 
Otherwise, you just cannot expect basically from the altcoins to recover. So first step, BTC to the all-time high, Ethereum to the all-time high, and then along the way, altcoins will recover as well. 72% folks for the first target, which is significant. It's great, sounds beautiful. Going forward with the next one, I will consider basically the possibility to push into the golden pocket of the upper structure and then might retrace a little bit, but let me just clear up the other chart from there. I have to, you know, clear those lines, put them away on the side. So, you know, let's let's get into the golden pocket, reverse back to our uh, demand zone at that time and continue basically into the upper structure. This is how an altcoin bull market will actually start for eGold on high probabilities, right? So the first target is sitting on 50s with possibilities of extending that into the 60s. From 60s, I would actually require, and it's most likely mandatory for the markets to come back into the you know, 50s, 45, I mean, anything that touches the zone is fine, which means as low as 45. In that case scenario, you must bounce. That bouncing is giving you a very strong signal and probability to push into 75 bucks. That $75 movement from the current level is just going to pay you very, very well, guys. 160% at the end of the day is a great return. So this is where we are with Eagle. I mean, at the moment, you're just going through, you know, an extremely difficult times for the ones that are sitting in longs in the highs, especially longs above $60, right? If you've been caught into those longs, there have been many opportunities for Eagle to react and deliver, uh, you know, bounce things, for example, from here or from the golden pockets, you know, the pennant down the way here, the descending triangle pennant, that pattern is usually a market continuation pattern. So if you are coming from a selling pressure you are continuing in the selling pressure which is what you get delivered no surprise out of that one unfortunately uh, not many chances to react out of that pennant differently than we have reacted at the end of the day the rejection we get today and what we're supposed to get in the upcoming days around this levels should be significant right so the buying pressure for the alts gotta step into however you need to be very patient, guys, with the markets at this level. You just cannot expect from the space right now in the upcoming days uh, to deliver you the $50 straight away. This is the number one condition anyone that is dealing with this levels must understand. If you have not sold and if you're in minus, then this is the worst place of doing it. It's the worst place of doing it. And you got to consider by marking the level you sell here and see yourself where are you going to be in the you know, event of a six months, 12 months representation from today. I mean, this is the worst place possible. It is a market situation that comes after a correction from the highs representing 65%. So if you sell after the market has been correcting 65%, that is a terrible strategy of trading that you need to avoid at any cost if you haven't sold so far. If you sold and you have an opportunity to buy cheaper then this is a very good edge at the level we're talking about right now especially on the spot where a very small leverage out there of course this is not an investment or financial device this is most likely a representation on what does the markets share with us and portray to us in terms of numbers so if we go out there on the weekly chart folks and we consider eagle well you kind of see how terrible it is to sell it down here Take a look at that. You had your BTC ETF rally. You've completely banished that away. You had a double top here putting together resistance and nothing reacted afterwards. Um, of course, a massive disappointment. But this is happening across the altcoins. This is happening across the altcoins. You just got quite a few of them delivering in this period. Other than the majority are doing what Eagle did. So that's the thing, folks. Now... What do you want to expect basically on longer term? Well, you don't want to sell anything below $200. Of course, 200 bucks is a level with clear tops and liquidities. Uh, I mean, we're not sitting in a bad shape even right now, just like I said, for longing it, you're actually longing it in the lowest part of the structure and you're good to go for the highs. If you're selling it here, look at the charts. Where are you selling, folks? Look at the charts. Where are you dumping your positions? It's just pretty much like I said. Uh, the worst place possible on earth to and the worst moment out there to dump it of course 
That's where we are, folks, with this one. Once again, check out this video till the end to find out more about a coaching program or the done for you trading in details. You can also see the video with explanation and register now for a free conversation with me. Enjoy. And now I would like to talk for those of you that believe in education and care about their performance. So it's time to share more details about my one on one coaching program. This is done with me live, where I'll take you by hand, just like I said, and teach you how to trade from A to Z, which means starting from the mindset psychology side into the technical analysis, understanding the language of the market, encrypting the charts and being familiar with the language in terms of what does the market communicates with you, understand the whole process and then know how to react to those messages that the markets are delivering to you guys. Knowing how to react obviously is a sophisticated process how to trade, when to trade, what to trade, when to exit, how to exit, and how to deal with an active trade. All the situations that are considered complex and a trader needs to know. Whether we talk about part-time or full-time trading, it doesn't matter. What matters is you need to increase your educational level in order to perform in the markets correctly and most likely in a predictable way. Trading is not gambling. Not at all. Trading is a type of activity where a person is trading an asset when the probabilities of a direction are very high. So he has the ability to recognize those moments when a probability compared to the other, so a energy of bullishness or bearishness, is having a very, very strong possibilities of going into a direction. This is when a trader steps in and it is in advantage towards the market, so he is trying to make money with that. That's the whole idea of the process. It's definitely not something that has a very, very high level of unknown and random outcome at all the times. No, there are situations like that as well. I can confirm that I've been trading since 2014 full time. But the idea is that there are situations where the randomness or the unpredictability is not high. And that makes the spots for the traders. So check out the video to understand how does it work. I register now for a free conversation with me, a one-on-one -on -one coaching where I'll take you by hand between four to six weeks and teach you how to trade on Zoom conversations with homework, with exercises, with everything that is needed. Just like for the completely done for you on the trading side, if you'd like to be part of my trades, you can definitely do so without any prior fees. Just a commission from the profits we earn. Commission is paid by you every seven days. This is my journey. You can check out the links in the description area, in the comments area for everything. It's completely done for you. We are using our ChatGPT bot for trading. It helps us to perform and help us to run the analysis and it helps for the accuracy side. So it's done through API trading permission and it's simple, straightforward. I can explain you more. Just reach out to me if you think this is a good option for you. Have a good time around it. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, and we'll talk to you soon.